good afternoon actually when pinky became president of flow india the kind of uh, energy she, she was uh, exuding the kind of enthusiasm she was exuding I, i almost felt that she has become the president of india or something figure you know, it's as good i'm i was hoping she would be here i could pull a leg you know but she said she had to leave but nevertheless congratulations i know this has been uh, it's taken a while to come um congratulations the state of telangana today in fact has uh, nearly 250 acres of land for women entrepreneurs only and these are dedicated parks so we have uh, 50 acres which has been allotted in sultanpur and uh, we also have uh, for another organization called kove we have about 30 acres in tupran and then we have uh, for elip we have about 120 acres so all in all i believe it is about 200 my apologies 200 acres of land which is already available and uh, i'm glad uh, jotsna mentioned that this is all sold out so delighted and happy that uh, you know you guys are all set to take off right now and um, jotsna i assure you and all the flow members here if you guys are wanting more land if you guys are wanting another park we'd be happy to make it happen and uh, we are looking at two interesting locations we are looking at uh, two very interesting locations where uh, we are setting up multiple things and we'd be happy to uh, let you explore with uh, jayesh and narsimha reddy well in this sultanpur land in fact uh, this is right next to the med devices park med devices and the importance of med devices in today's india i think you all understand very well um, what we had done then was just to make your life easy we took about 50 acres from the med devices park and we actually gave it at a very subsidized rate and i'm excited that it's all sold out and i'm also um, i also wanted to point out the basic infrastructure roads power water etc is all being done unlike any other industrial park in the state for your park it is it is all being done at the government's cost normally you would have to pay the large number of industrial parks we have in telangana more than 140 now we have earmarked 10% of the land in these industrial parks each and every one of them for women entrepreneurs so it's not as if you only have 50 acres or 100 acres you have many many opportunities and should you wish to explore where these are available and where these are uh, you know readily available our tsic would be more than happy to facilitate that uh, conversation and we will also put them up online so that you can actually take a look at the different maps etc etc the other thing i also wanted to point out um, rastesh i think you should uh, come back to hyderabad more often i think you should uh, definitely come see us more often you're working with us in urban development department edelweiss the other hat that you wear so my request is i think you should invest more in hyderabad no uh, not just you know come and pay us compliments once in a while you should invest more you should also possibly buy a house here great city to make a second home if need be yeah so possibly take a look at that i'm sure we'll make will some of these very very powerful ladies will get you good discounts and all also i can assure you that well on the infrastructure side we have uh, started working my tsic team here tells me that uh, whatever little glitches there were in the existing land couple of mines that had to be removed couple of not mines but uh, crushers etc that had to be removed have been moved out and uh, i do hope jayesh was just pointing out i do hope that all of these enterprises that are coming up here i'm told about 1500 employees would be working out of this park i do hope majority of them would be women of course i don't want you to you guys to be sexist and employ only women but i think uh, it would be important to send out a very strong message um, to the world out there that women entrepreneurs and these kind of parks can do very very well and can flourish without and on an even keel without a great deal of additional incentives from the governments so good luck and uh, jotsna you've uh, pestered me enough to make it uh, to this event i hope you continue to do that because persistence is important i think it's extremely important to be persistent to be pushy you don't have to feel sorry about it that's our job so please uh, continue to push me jayesh narsimha reddy balamallu garu everybody else on the dais to make this happen quickly all the very best good luck